Howdy y'all, Lone Star Rider here. This is part 14 in the trailer build series. Y'all stick around. Lone Star Rider on his motorcycle. If you guys haven't seen 1 through 13, there's going to be a link up above or down in the description. You can catch up. Yeah, you can catch up. get some welding done from Ronnie and a big thanks to Ronnie I uh, had to get the uh, top part shored up and uh, he did an awesome job just like he did last time thanks Ronnie really appreciate it these are the uh, these are the weld that Ronnie did for me bracing this up because I had a couple of them break when I came back so when I get back over to Lake Jackson, I'm going to grind these down smooth and make them look good. And then I'll start gluing in the panels. And then also riveting them in. Anyway, it's looking good.
came back from uh, Austin, was at Bruceville the day before yesterday, and Ronnie welded some brackets to firm up this upper part here. And me and a friend, Annette, we went over to Louis Mueller's um, barbecue in Taylor, Texas. And then we went over to Austin. And then the next day, we went to the Oasis. And you're saying, well, Rex, you're supposed to be working on the trailer. Yes, I am. But Doug and Tracy had some family come over, and I made myself scarce for the weekend. So I got the trailer welded and got some things ordered that come in today. And I grinded all that weld when I got back. And I glued in a couple of panels. I ran out of glue. I'm gonna to have to get some more tomorrow. And the, the panels, this one's just holding it down. But I glued the uh, roof in and that panel there in. Got these uh, hinges in today and they're uh, supposed to be stainless steel boat hinges. Anyway, I believe they'll work. And I ordered these off of Amazon. There we go. So this should work for the hinges on the door and the hinges on the, uh, the trunk lids. Got 10 of them here. All right, guys, today is July 14th. Um, I'm bundling these days in because I'm doing pretty much the same thing every day. Uh, anyway, I've got, all right, got the top glued in and this back panel put in. Yeah, it's upside down. That would be the back panel. So got some more glue of this Loctite PL 3X Stronger Premium Construction Adhesive. This stuff holds awesome. So now I'm going to put in the rest of the panels today and then I'll prep them for the poor man's fiberglass and a million people in the crowd but I only see your face in all the lights and as the bass keep pounding on me baby I really want to make you mine I don't really care about love I don't really care about happy ever afters something about you gives me Let me show you. All right, I got all the panels in in the upper part here. And this right here is the doorway and that is the roof area. And I've got the glue in. I got a lot accomplished today. Oh, one more thing too. I, uh, I got some white enamel to test out the paint on top of the glue here. And this is the bad part in the back. It's not dry yet, but the enamel looks pretty good on there. I'm supposed to put three coats of that on there um, and lightly sand it in between each coat. So we'll see how that turns out. All right, we'll do another day tomorrow and uh, keep chugging on with this. Today is July, Wednesday the 15th. And I've been continuing doing the uh, gluing which I'm done on the outside. And then uh, I'm gonna start doing the painting on it. I still want somebody to wrap it, but if nobody's gonna wrap it, I gotta paint it. <laughs> Cause I can't afford the, the wrap. All right, I did a uh, enamel paint over this to do a test. So I'm gonna do a light sanding and then uh, spray it again and see how well this turns out. Didn't take much to uh, take that layer off, so I'm gonna do another layer on here. All right, we're gonna let that dry 
try and see how that works. cut a hole for the Mac stand. Figured why waste glue on something that's going to be cut out and not used. Uh, I already put two layers on it. Should have cut it off earlier. Uh, anyway, it's right dead in the center of the top. Uh, there's enough room for the solar panel and enough room for a another solar panel if I decide to do that probably not maybe never know uh, but everything has been glued three layers of this glue stuff and I used the fabric on it and I put three layers of uh, enamel on top of this after doing the glue looks like it's pretty good of uh, rust-oleum white kind of glossy but not quite I forgot what they call that. Anyway, looks good. Ah, fenders came in today. Fenders are uh, made out of plastic and they're light. <laughs> Doesn't matter. Uh, it, the, the fenders keep the mud from slinging all over the place, so. Which is good. Gotta make things lighter. All right, I think I'm done for today because it's already 6.30. I might do some more tonight, but I am bushed. did uh i believe is the last coat of glue with the exception of that back wall i got to do another coat there and then tomorrow i'm going to be putting enamel on here three coats light sanding in between each one uh, this is the hatch for the sitting area and the bed and that's the hatch for the bed and this is the paint I'm going to be using it's called uh, exterior semi gloss enamel and it's from Burr Burr is that how you say that Burr Ultra anyway we'll see how that works this was done with a spray can and it worked out pretty darn good but took is gonna take a lot of spray cans for this so I'm going to be rolling this stuff on. And I'll be so glad and done with gluing and painting. Of course, I got to do the lower section too. I got to paint it. All right. I'm continuing on. And I'm hoping to have this all done within two weeks. Did you say two weeks, Rex? Yes, I did. So that's the goal. By the end of this month, get this to a point to where I can at least take it out and go. Uh, my stay here has been way too long. If you guys are not subscribed to me, y'all should be. Click on that subscribe button down below and then hammer the hell out of that bell and you'll get an email notification that I've uploaded a video. And if you like this video, give it a big thumbs up, share, comment, let me know what you think. Catch y'all on the road. Hi Rex. Cut it up. Cut it it. I cut it it it. <laughs> this is probably not the end of the video. I'll probably cut this out. <laughs> this is more of a note for myself. Uh, I'm going to make sure I get all the uh, gluing done and ready to go. And then I'll start number 15. Yeah. 
there's already this is number 14 so it's a it's gonna be a long series uh, hopefully not 20 <laughs> maybe <laughs> hopefully hopefully it'll end at 15 now yeah, 16 17 18 uh, hope it ends at no further than 18 and hopefully 16 maybe 17 I don't know Anyway, getting closer to being done, so that's a good thing.